Welcome back everyone to a new tutorial here on my channel. It's been a while since I first released my uh, combined iron village breeder farm thing. And huge thanks to all of those views. And uh, now I have come up with a little kelp farm. I swear I saw it turtle um it's very simple this is how i recommend to do it uh, but you can get it as small as four by four by four um this is not even necessary so four by four by three that's, I think that's the smallest you, this hole should not be here, that's just so I can uh, show this wouldn't pop out there if it's, should have been not a hole. Uh, and as you see, it's working. Same with this. I'm going to show you how to do this. Start with digging a hole down and place something the kelp actually can grow on. And start off with a piston facing to the hole and on top of it you should use an observer <coughs> observer and yeah let's place this uh, I use a note block to the piston uh, just cause the update and then you can use a block of your choice over here so it detects stuff works just fine and for the walls I use glass because I like to see how it actually runs. Um, as I say, said before you can do it as high as you want but you actually don't need it higher than the dispen uh, observer so you can actually do it like this. That's like, this is probably the smallest one you can do. Uh, fill the hole up with water. Uh, wait before you put the last one in, of course. And then, uh, fill out the walls. And here you can choose to have uh, the hopper. You can have it already here if you want. Uh, but I like to have it right here. So, because I need that, uh, I like that little flow. And of course the chest. Then fill out the walls so it don't fly away. And now you can put down the water that flows to the hopper. And as you see right now, this is so easy. Uh, and plant plant uh, the kelp and it will grow kelp is not well sometimes it grow really fast but not always so don't be sad if it's don't grow like I don't know trees uh, but when it get up to the point of the observer of course it will and that's why I have a hole there uh, it will trigger the piston and take it away and they will fly away uh, one tip is of course to have a roof here because they can fly pretty bad <coughs> and this of course only works in 1.13 or oh, well you don't have the cap in uh, earlier versions but it's based on the floating uh, new floating thing with stuff in the water so yeah there's like nothing more to say about it. It's truly very simple. And I just realized that this video was a really short one. But as you see, now they will start popping out from the side. 
but it works just fine. And as far as I know, it's lossless. But of course, those are jumping out because of the hole. Um, so yeah, hope this would ha help someone. I have been tried some of my thoughts, but this is like the only one that I have got working. So, yeah, hope you enjoyed this and uh, hit me up if you have some ideas to make this more efficient. Of course, you can make it like double and uh, just make it long uh, if you want more, more flow of the kelp. But I like it this way. It's a small little farm. And why so big deal with kelp? It's let me grab a crafting table. First, you can actually you can don't eat this, but we can do it like this. Let's do it like this. Uh, Let's go in survival. And I'm not hungry, of course. Um, you can eat kelp, uh, dried kelp. And these blocks are actually. Oh, that was just dumb. Is actually. There's been so much new stuff. I can't even find what I'm. Um, is actually. And where did they? Oh, it's a really good uh, burning material, and it, I I think it's uh, better than coal blocks actually. But that that's just something I think I haven't checked that up. So yeah, kelp is the new deal, and it's have a pretty interesting. No. It's ugly. King's out. <laughs>